Did you ever have a family story that tickled you so much you just wanted to make it into a kid's book? In our family, I had always thought of this story with my grandma and an experience she had while trying to chase a mouse out of her house. I'm Sherry Burbach, a mixed media artist and writer. My grandma was one of my favorite people. She was a farm girl, someone who worked hard and especially took pride in keeping a clean home. She loved to cook and was someone that, although our personalities and backgrounds were quite different, that I really related to. She lived in a cottage across from this cornfield and one day she spotted a mouse in her house and it was almost time for bed. So to keep the mouse out of her room, she rolled up a towel and placed it under her door. When she woke up though, she realized she had actually locked the mouse inside her bedroom and you guessed it, there were mouse turds on her pillow. She was horrified, naturally, but as she shared the story, I started laughing. All I could picture was this cartoon mouse with a nightcap on, grabbing her little toothbrush and heading off to grandma's house for a sleepover. And being a writer and artist, I knew I had to make this into a kid's book. So first I wrote the story. Then I sketched out a draft with storyboards so I would know where to place the words and what kind of images I would need to create. Almost instantly, I knew what I wanted Margaret the Mouse to look like. She had pretty lilac colored fur and beautiful green eyes. I practiced drawing her with a variety of expressions because of course that's what helps tell the story. Creating the character of Granny was easy for me because I thought of my own grandma. I experimented with different ways to bring these characters to life and settled on using echoline colored pens to fill in the sketches I had created. I love the color and vibrancy of them. Then I laid out the book and put it together. It's amazing what we can do as artists today, isn't it? The technologies available allow us to create in ways we couldn't even do five or 10 years ago. If you have the urge to write a kid's book, I hope you'll do it. And also, I'd love it if you bought my kid's book, Mouse Turds on Granny's Pillow. Happy creating.